Y'all seen the little tubby boy from Lean On Me? And uh, he was still in Juice with, with Tupac and Omar Epps and the whole nine yards. Y'all yeah, remember him? Why has this man been caught? I think he was in Above the Rim too. But why has this man been caught with 200 pounds of weed? Like, what the fuck you doing with 200 pounds of weed? Like, you going down, you selling that shit. Ain't no way you can make an excuse. You can find your way out of that. You got 200 pounds of weed, nigga. You doing some major distribution. You ain't about to smoke no 200 pounds of weed right now. You ain't got that many friends that you about to smoke with that y'all about to blow through 200 pounds of weed right now. So his ass going down... With the intent to sell, he, no, no question. Got I got the article that I I first seen this on, in the description, so y'all can look into this if y'all care. But this nigga still, man, this nigga look fucking this nigga with the. F I guess acting wasn't. I haven't seen him in a long ass time. I guess the acting wasn't paying the bills. He had to get him a little side hustle. Well, I should remove the Lil out of that and probably Sire. That motherfucker was doing it fucking major if he was moving all of that shit. Buying that much at one fucking time. But, uh, that's some crazy shit. You see these niggas on TV and you think these niggas didn't made it. You think life is all to the motherfucking good. I know personally, if I was in that situation, if I had Hollywood Connects and I had, uh, movie money rolling in every time my, my shit add and all that kind of stuff get collecting my residuals I wouldn't I wouldn't be out there motherfucker doing nothing to jeopardize my situation that shit is, I'm sure is a whole lot better than where I'm living at right now so I mean I don't know if I gotta cut back on all these expensive cars and jewelry and clothes and hoes and cocaine or whatever the hell these niggas doing you just gotta make that sacrifice other than Jeopardizing your entire life when your life you you didn't have to like when you got these dirt poor ass niggas in the street doing that kind of shit it's like they got to like it's like it's either that or they starve you can kind of understand why but when you don't really need that shit like that what the fuck are you even doing but hey I guess he was just trying to get the juice he's trying to get the juice from Q I think it was Q who had the juice it's been a long time since I've seen that movie but Check it out. It's in the description if y'all give a fuck about it.